Life on our planet is incredibly diverse and complex. But where does this diversity and complexity come from? How does a caterpillar know to eat leaves? The answer is DNA, life's instruction manual, written in a language based on four molecules called nucleotides, referred to as A, C, T, and G. These occur in pairs in DNA. There are billions of these pairs, and it is the specific arrangement of these pairs that form the instructions for an organism, its genome. LifeScanner uses a method called DNA barcoding to analyze a small piece of tissue from a specimen, isolating a short segment of its genome to identify it. How does LifeScanner work? Simply collect a specimen with our collection kit, use the LifeScanner app to record important information about it, and send the completed kit to us. When your specimen arrives at one of our partner labs, it is given a unique ID number and linked to you. You can then use the LifeScanner app to track its journey through the DNA barcoding identification process. First, a small portion of tissue is taken and your specimen's DNA is isolated and extracted from the cells. Only a small part of this DNA is necessary for species identification, the DNA barcode. But we need to make many copies of this segment to be able to read it. We use a technique called PCR to exponentially increase the number of copies of our target segment of DNA, the DNA barcode. This gives us sufficient genetic material to use in the next step, DNA sequencing. To prepare the DNA for sequencing, we create a mixture of the PCR copied DNA, regular A's, C's, T's, and G's, and special fluorescently tagged A's, C's, T's, and G's. DNA polymerase replicates the input DNA with regular nucleotides and incorporates fluorescent nucleotides at random positions, creating DNA fragments of different sizes and ending at every possible position in the target segment. A special machine then analyzes the prepared sample by reading the fluorescent nucleotides in order of size. The machine produces a long string of A, T, C, and G characters. The arrangement is converted to a digital sequence that is unique for each species and is between 500 to 600 characters long. This sequence is the DNA barcode for your specimen and can be used to identify it. Computer software is used to compare your specimen's barcode to a global species database to determine the closest match to your specimen's sequence. Once a match is made, you will then receive details about the species you collected. The data you collect with LifeScanner and the DNA barcode obtained from your specimen will be submitted to the International Barcode of Life Project and added to a global scientific database. These DNA barcodes will help researchers around the world study these species further. Become a citizen scientist and contribute to the scientific record. Order the LifeScanner DNA Species Identification Kit to identify organisms around you.